I welcome all to this program Voice of Saints. Today our Holy Catholic Church celebrate the feast of Saint Hermengild. Leovigild, Arian king of the Visigoths, had two sons, Hermengild and Ricard, who were reigning conjointly with him. All were Arians, but Hermengild married a zealous Catholic, the daughter of Sigebert. king of france and by her holy example was converted to the faith his father on hearing the news denounced him as a traitor and marched to seize his person hermengild tried to rally the catholics of spain in his defense but they were too weak to make any stand and after a two years fruitless struggle hermengild surrendered on the assurance of a free pardon once he was safely in the royal camp the king had him loaded with fetters and cast into a fall dungeon at seven tortures and bribes were in turn employed to shake his faith but hemengel wrote to his father that he regarded the crown as nothing and preferred to lose scepter and life rather than betray the truth of god at length on easter night an arian bishop entered his cell and promised him his father's pardon if he would receive communion from his hands hemengild indignantly rejected the offer and knelt with joy for his death stroke praying for his persecutors the same night a light streaming from his cell told the christians keeping vigil nearby that the martyr had won his crown and was celebrating the resurrection of the lord with the saints in glory king leo wigild on his deathbed was changed interiorly he had been witness to the miracles that had occurred after his son's cruel death and he told his son and successor ricard to seek out saint leander whom he himself had persecuted ricard should follow hemengil's example said the king and be received by the bishop into the church ricard did so and although his father himself had not had the courage to renounce the false faith publicly after his father's death the new king labored so earnestly for the extirpation of arianism that he brought over the whole nation of the visigoths to the church nor is it to be wondered says saint gregory that he came thus to be a preacher of the true faith since he was the brother of a martyr whose merits helped him to bring so many into the heaven of god's church reflection the victory of saint hermengild teaches us that constancy and sacrifice are the best arguments for the faith and the surest way to win souls to god on behalf of saints fans association i am wishing you all a happy feast of saint hermengild amen